So unfortunately, I couldn't go see the Benghazi movie or the uh, Ride Along 2 or North of Norm this week just because it had some car trouble. So hopefully I'll get that fixed soon. But I did see some independent movies, so here comes the first few, well, the first one that I'm going to do. Hey guys, thank you for joining the quest. I am your host Marquise Underwood and today I'll be reviewing Diablo, which is directed by Lawrence Rowick and it stars Scott Eastwood. Yes, Clint Eastwood's son. And let's see how this western turned out. And honestly, this western, it was uh, nothing really too special. The plot of this movie is that this guy who is a Civil War veteran, a young Civil War veteran is that, his wife is kidnapped so he's just on a journey trying to find his wife and find out who took her and stuff like that and basically it's a revenge tale. And this one kind of follows all the cliches of a western movie but I think it does those cliches very poorly in my estimation. To me the movie kind of felt like a, a satire of sorts, an unintentional satire of the whole western genre. It felt like Scott Eastwood doing his best Clint Eastwood impression and I understand he's trying to live up to his father's expectations and you know the, the stigma and the status of his father but I just felt like this one fell short especially with all the recent hits of westerns like Bone Tomahawk, um, Echoes of War. I just feel like this one was a little bit beyond those actually. Well a lot beyond them. The acting in the movie was okay. It was nothing really special. The only person who really did anything magnificent in my eyes was Walter Goggins. I thought he did a phenomenal job of acting in a supporting role. Um, I wish there was like 10 of him in this movie, but unfortunately there's not. And it's a decent western. They do have the atmosphere right, the locations and the settings and the production designs with the costumes and stuff like that. They did all that right. I just felt like when it comes to the script, it's just kind of uh, a cliche and just kind of boring in my eyes, honestly. And like I said before, it's really unintentional how the film came off, I think. I think Scott Eastwood and the director Lawrence Roick, I think they honestly had a certain theme that they were trying to go for. In my eyes, it just didn't work. Um, it's kind of predictable, honestly. And unfortunately, I just, I just thought it sucked, to be completely honest. It took the movie from being here to maybe being down here, and that's not a good thing. And for that, I'm gonna give this movie a D, uh, 1.5 out of five. Honestly, I thought the movie was okay, nothing special. Um, I, I'm kinda looking forward to see what Scott Eastwood does next. I know he's trying to live out his father's shadow and do something separate. So hopefully the next one's better, but I just thought this one was okay. So, have you seen Diablo? If you have, comment below and let me know your thoughts on the movie. Again, I'm your host, Marquise Underwood. And join the quest.